my beautiful and amazing family how are you all doing thank you very much for always supporting me i really do appreciate if to those of us that you are coming across this channel this is agatha progress channel on youtube and i come across your way every blessed day as you can see in this channel we react to all videos and in this channel all opinion is highly needed in the comment section and if you love what i am doing in this channel why don't you click on that button that says subscribe and turn on the bell icon so that we become one big family all right my wonderful family this video we're about to watch i don't know how you felt about this video but i do hope you got some lesson from it all right my wonderful people let's go straight into the video now watch it invade the house and that was when he called me he says dog can you hear the, the the gunshots you know I, I panicked I started screaming I said what's going on what's going on he said to me the military men are here they are shooting loads and loads of people died lost their lives and Nam the Colonel is nowhere to be found I mean I, I mean how do you how do you raise a child who has a father but doesn't have a father for what what do you do <laughs> it's difficult that's very emotional, okay. Um, do, you, do you show him pictures? What do you do? Yes, before the invasion, we would, you know, be on, um, we're doing um, a WhatsApp, um, Skype um, video call, and so he knows him. And now that he's not even, we don't know where he is, if he's alive or dead. He goes sometimes, he, just, he says, Daddy, and that kills me more, because <laughs> I don't know what to say to him. Was there any feeling at the time that what he was doing could be a dangerous but also quite possibly illegal and would put him in the radar of the government? What makes it illegal? If you call for the breakup of the state, then that could be seen as treasonous. Why? Why should I be treasonous? One asking for self-determination. Um, how is that a crime? It's not a crime. What do you say to those, and this is something that I've heard a lot, which is that um, your husband left his family in the safety of Britain to go to Nigeria and encourage people to, in a sense, die for a cause that he was not willing to put his family at risk for? Do, you, do they even know what I go through? It's something I, I can't explain. My parents-in-law, I don't know where they are. Nobody has a home. We are homeless. He's not a sacrifice. We are suffering it too. So whereby he's in this very uh, mission is, is the utmost sacrifice. Winnie Mandela, she, she, she once was an exile. She went on exile. The, the children suffered. So that is what happened. So if somebody sits back and said, your family is not, the pressing is the most, is one of, is the typical stupid African pressing we're talking about. Because you need to reason that for this man to do this, his family is the, is the number one risk. Because when they go for him, after him, the next person is his wife. So looking ahead to the, looking ahead to the next election, do you think that your husband's issue should be one of the things which people think about as they go to the polls? In the next coming election, you need to have that in mind, that for us to ever be better, we need to stand up. Yes, the Colonel's issue should be the number one thing. Where is he? You need to provide him, at least tell us where he is. You need to at least do something before you run an election. Otherwise, we're not going to vote. Yes, that is the wife of the leader of Biafra, Mazina de Kalu. Why some people say they don't have wife. Now you've seen for yourself. All right, my wonderful people, let us go to the next news. British High Commissioner replies Mazina de Kanu Slater. You know, yesterday we uploaded a video uh, about Mazina de Kanu appealing to UK government for support, and now they've replied. So let us see what the re response is. The British High Commissioner in Nigeria has acknowledged the receipt of the letter written on behalf of the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Mazina de Kalu, seeking its support as a British citizen. In the acknowledged letter sent to Kanu's council, a Jemuka on Tuesday, 6th July 2021, the British authority guarantee 
the protection of Mazina the Kanu's welfare. That is a great development. Ejo Maka said, the letter specifically stated that Kanu will get support and welfare of the British authority. Record that Kanu, through Ejimoke Petition and British High Commissioner, requested that Mr. Kanu be granted every possible counsel assistance to which he is entitled as a British citizen. When the barrister was contacted, he said what is written on the letter is confidential. In his words, Ejimke said, yesterday I received a response from the British High Commission acknowledging receipts of the letter and telling me what the British authority can do for Mazina de Kalu as a citizen of British. The content of the letter is highly confidential, so I can't say more than that. I understand the public has a right to know the development, but I cannot reveal all the content which is the key to our strategy. You see what is going on right now. Biafra, they are not coming online to shout. They are not coming online to talk, but they have their own strategy. So they are in one-on-one -on -one with the British government. The British government is already on this issue. So let us hope for the best. When asked about Kanu's health condition, the legal petitioner stated that the Nigerian government has not allowed him to see his daughter. They brought daughters to DSS department, but his health condition is beyond that. It requires him to see his special daughter because of the seriousness of his health issue. The lawyer went on to say even the British authority know that only a suspect that is physically fit can stand trial so they are going to see to his welfare as his lawyer we have to make sure he gets all his entitlement under the law he is entitled to administrative or judiciary bail regardless of the degree of his offense but if he denies we will take it from there but we believe that based on the doctrine of presumptions of innocence everyone is entitled to bail until they approve otherwise so my wonderful family that is a good one that is coming from the british government we are so happy and we hope for the best and more to come so this moment i will urge everyone to stay calm and don't forget to pray what you have right now is prayer and i believe that the supreme leader of bia from mazina de Kalu will come out of this in jubilation and in happiness we all we dance together if you know enemies if you have enemies that you can assist is better at this particular time show us what you can do and assist in all areas all right my wonderful family i am so blessed having you all and it is better and it is good and it is so loveful as you promote this channel and always share our video art i am I'm so grateful and if you are here you have not joined this family yet what are you waiting for oh my word please click on that button that says subscribe and turn on the bell icon so that whenever we upload a new video you will be the first to notify all right my wonderful family see you when i